This is just an explanation of the sound. In case it sounds like it's not making any sound, so if he's in the Say Some More app or he's playing music, um, it's not playing right now. You can see the triangle icon when it's playing. I found out. You know, that was an example of music that was working, right? Um, right here, this eighth inch jack. Um, you want to make sure whether or not that's plugged in. If it is plugged in, just make sure that the speaker is turned on. You see the red lights, and there's an on button. You can hold down the on button. Um, if it's off, then when you hold it down, it'll turn on. If it's on, when you hold it down, like this here, hold it for three seconds. Power off. It tells you power off. Power on. Power on. There's also a volume down and volume up button on either side of here. And on the top edge of the iPad, this is the corner here. We're looking at the top left corner. There's a volume up and volume down button. They're kind of hard to see. When you adjust them on the screen, you'll see it'll appear a little um, representation of the volume level. Um, I'll show you that. Um, it only works when the volume is, uh, there we go, Actually, okay, so when I'm pressing the volume up and down, you can see volume's at maximum, I generally keep it on maximum, and then change the volume level on the speaker. But sometimes if you're not hearing anything, maybe the volume is too low, if the volume is too low, it'll look like that, it's muted, and you can put it up hold the volume up to the top. Use that to troubleshoot the volume.